Listen up, my gamers. Listen up, my gamers. Out here in YouTube land, Twitter and Instagram. Listen up here, man. Listen. Let me tell you something. Let me let me freaking tell you something, man. I'ma tell you something like that. You're not gonna freaking like it. FIFA 2022 is gonna be the best version on Stadia. And I'm gonna explain you why on Google Stadia. You just entered chat, man. Gaming. Get the hell out of here! One switch? Get the hell out of here! Chariot Man Gaming. What is going on, everybody out here in YouTube land? This is Chariot Man Gaming, and I'm coming at you with another video, with an exciting video and news update. And before I get started in this exciting news update, don't forget to hit that like button, share, subscribe to Chariot Man Gaming. Hit the smash this like button, smash the subscribe button, hit the notifications if you want more videos just like this. As you seen today, and if you don't like this hit video, take the goddamn keyboard, take your goddamn cell phone, and send it all the way out there to the goddamn depths of the goddamn barren city. And hit my mini islands, hit my mini islands, and Chariot Man Gaming right there on the left side, Chariot Man Gaming on Twitter, and Chariot Man Gaming 85, Chariot Man 85 on Instagram. Now, let's get into this exciting video and news update because you people are going to freaking hate me you're goddamn right you're going to hate me dumb this goddamn video down you understand my gamers dumb it all down all my xbox series all my xbox series x hold up gotta drink something ice cold water yeah, that tastes good all my xbox series x and the playstation 5 owners Dumb the goddamn video down, even PC. Dumb the goddamn video down. Dumb the damn shit down. Dumb it down, man. Dumb my videos down right now, because you're going to hate this. And why I explain this on Eurogamer, it says here, FIFA 22, more, PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, and Stadia exclusives features reviewed. Cheerio. Um, they mentioned Stadia, but where the hell's PC? They mentioned Stadia, but there's no PC version. All right, there's there's something wrong here. But but also listen to this by Wesley Lynn Poole. Listen to this. EA Sports has announced a number of new FIFA 22 features exclusive to the game on PlayStation 5. Xbox Series X and S and Stadia. Stadia, but no PCs. Remember what I said before in the other video, because people think that the, the Stadia version of FIFA 2022 is not going to be next gen. They said, no, it's not going to have all the next gen features. But this video confirms the goddamn video. It confirms everybody rhetoric. It confirms that theory. This theory is confirmed that the Stadia version is indeed a next gen version and it's going to be the best next gen version and I will explain why. Listen to this. In fully revealing FIFA 22 career mode yesterday, EA Sports confirmed more features you won't get on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, or PC. Yup. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. It says again, EA Sports confirmed more features you won't get. You won't get it. All right? You won't get it on X on PlayStation 4, Xbox One, of course. But PC, the PC version is still last gen version. So you're going to pay, like I was saying in my last video, you're going to be paying thousands of dollars on a new graphics PC. But you can't get it on Stadia. You can't get this. You can't get the next gen feature. You're paying thousands of dollars for the uh, the GTX 3390, 380. The GTX that costs like two thousand dollars a piece, and you can't get the next gen version. What kind of crap is that? And that's what it's talking about here. Bruh. So these are the features that it's talking about. All right. And I want you to listen to this. I have to say it's going to be pretty long. So bear with this. Bear with this. Brace yourselves. In the career mode across all platforms. There are new items focused on your status and accomplishments that trigger when certain milestones events happen. For example, when you and one of your player goal protection is to break a competition goal record and when you or they finally succeed in doing so. But, 
on PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, S, and Stadia, those accomplishments aren't just celebrated in the news. These versions of FIFA 2022 also have the pre match in Queen's Secrets, which the commander Combinator team picks up on where you have achieved. New cinematics include new team warm-up sequences, dressing room movements, team expecting the patch as well as the groundkeeper making last name preparations. If your team is under underperforming in an important match, you might even see the crowd leaving early, EA said. Oh my god! On Stadia, that shows that Stadia is next gen and it's gonna be oh my god. God, man, and a PC is not going to get that. <laughs> dumb the video down. Just dumb it down, man. Dumb the goddamn video down. Also, listen to this. We also got more information on Scott Alex Scott's commentary. It comes with Viva the Gold News from Elsewhere commentary in English, with Scott providing minute by minute updates to matches players simultaneously. Simultaneously. We are using the latest technology to make sure that the transitions between the commentary team and Alex Scott sound nature as possible. EA Sports said, with interruptions possible. Now, this one is gonna kill it right here. I, I, I can't believe this is happening right now. And people bash Stadia. Now, I got nothing against the Xbox Series X and PlayStation 5. Those are great consoles. Those are great platforms. Even Steam, I like those platforms. I might even get one, but this is not good. This is big for Stadia. If people can't see that this is big, I don't know what to tell you. Listen to, listen to what it has to say. These next gen only features join what EA calls hyper motion gameplay, which combines machine learning with 11 versus 11 motion capture to improve how players move during a match. And being exclusive to FIFA 22 on PS5, Xbox Series X, S, and Stadia, but there's no PC involved. So this is only Stadia. So Stadia must have forked over a whole, a whole lot of money to do this. Google has the money and they have the power and the resources to do this. And this is why they're able to get the next gen features. And it proves, and it proves, and it proves, I'm going to keep saying that it proves that the damn server blades are powerful and they're updating the damn server blades. Okay? That means it's going to be next gen games because they talked about 8K, 4K. Why would the hell they talked about this? Now, this is going to really blow everything away. Listen to what it has to say. You're gonna hate me. That leaves out PC. You heard it right. PC, that leaves out PC. PlayStation 4, of course, Xbox One, and Switch. Yeah, of course, Switch to Switch. Nintendo ain't gonna get that much love from NBA. But I don't think anyone was expecting anything other than by the numbers, Legacy Edition for Nintendo console this year. Of course, Nintendo console. But PC has been left out, okay? PC has been left out. But you know what? Google Stadia is gonna get the same goddamn next gen features as the Xbox Series X and the PlayStation 5. But why is it gonna be the best version? Because the Stadia version is gonna be paying $79.99 of smackers for the for the old premiere version and 99.99 and 99 cents. Meanwhile, you can't get the PlayStation 5 and Xbox Series X. If anybody wanted to get those versions, if you don't got the consoles, you can't get those versions because it's freaking hard to get an Xbox Series X and the PlayStation 5 consoles these days. It's hard to pick up one. But Stadia is available all over the place and on Best Buy, the freaking stars is, is alignment. The, 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 the review scores is going crazy and the game is $59.99 of smackers on the um, stadium version and standard edition but look at this the standard edition on the Xbox Series X is $69.99 of smackers on the next edition for the next gen version on the new console and on the PlayStation 5 and it has a line $59 for the um, Xbox One and PlayStation 4 $69.99 snacks of smackers on the PlayStation 5 and you know the other version is going to be a lot more and you know the PC versions that you see right here is six is $59.99 but that's the old gen version on PC but the stadium is the, is the key $59.99 all right five nine 
$1.99, you'll be able to get the next gen version of FIFA 2022. Are you freaking serious? That is freaking big. This is gonna bring more players to the Google Stadia platform. This is perfect. So Google forked over a lot of money. Google is not messing around, and I'm excited about this. People think Stadia is a joke. I knew what the hell I was doing when I joined this platform. I believe in this freaking platform. I know this platform is gonna blow up, and I'm telling you, that's why I'm in this platform. I got nothing against the PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X. I might even pick up one. I might, might as well might pick up one because they got games I want to play. You know what I'm saying? But right now, Stadia is going to be the real deal. It's here to stay, and I'm going to keep talking about this because you're not going to respect it, and I got to keep bringing out the videos because you're not going to stop bringing out videos. So, my gamers, let me know what you think about this crazy news about the Stadia version. It's going to be, FIFA 2022 is going to be the best, it's going to be the Stadia version, and it's going to be the best version because it's going to be damn cheaper. Okay? It's going to be the cheapest version, and it's going to be hey, easy to success. You'll be able to play on every device. Cell phones, monitors, TVs. With the Google freaking TV right here, the Google TV, the watch on, all right? Google watch on is accessible everywhere. Hey, you can't beat it. So let me know in the comments. And all I have to say is sound off in the comment section and tell me what you think about this freaking news you hear today. And don't forget to hit that like button share and subscribe to chariot man gaming and to smash this like button smash that like button and subscribe button if you want more videos just like this as you've seen today and i'm going to say peace and i thank all of my new subscribers i thank you guys out here for helping me pushing my channel to new heights thank you for all the new subscribers appreciate you coming through welcome to chariot man gaming i got more content on the way I'm not going to let you guys down. I'm going to keep pushing hard for you guys, all the new subscribers, all my team, people that support me. And I got more content on the way. And I'm going to say peace. And I'm going to talk to you guys soon. Oh, and I got something for you guys. Just to let you know. Peace.